Hey, there's nothing wrong with it, brothers and sisters. This is the one called Stupid. Could it be like a voodoo doll or am I just over exaggerating? $23.50. Hey, yo, get out of here with this dog. I check out the vlog I just post. Stupid. And look it. They demonetized this joint. Why? Why, YouTube? Why? There's nothing wrong with it, brothers and sisters. Limited or no ads due to content identified as not suitable. You know, I got to request a manual review. Talking about something we're not going to be able to review it until you get a thousand views. Sure. Tell that to someone else because you review my videos before they reach a thousand views. Submit, mofos. Uh, what is it? What is it? What could be preventing this from being monetizable? Now your boy can't make no pennies off of this, dog. Come on, man. I was collecting them pennies for a trip to Dubai. Now they drawling. I got to wait for 1,000 views. And... So let's analyze the details. We're in my creator studio looking at my videos. Let's scroll all the way down to where my buddy Walt passed away, right? Check this out. I need you guys to see that. You see that? See the ones with Walt? You see that dollar sign? You see how it's not green? It's not turned on? That means I'm not monetizing any of those videos that had to do with Walt. Look at, check it out. You see? For about a week, week and a half, I wasn't monetizing none of them. I'm not gonna sit there and make profit, or in my case, like I like to say, pennies off of my buddy Walt situation, right? Now, when we go all the way up, I start monetizing them around, you know, the beats and carrot juice and all that stuff. Let's go all the way up to my most recent one. And we're gonna look at the top. This is the one called Stupid, right? Stupid. And if you take a look at that vlog, do me a favor, go watch it. Let me know if you think anything is not suitable for advertisers. Call me crazy. But I'm gonna try something. I'm gonna click edit on the stupid vlog, right? And you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna change the thumbnail. And for the thumbnail, I'm gonna put this one right here. Check it out. This is the original one that I was gonna use, but YouTube suggested that cover art with him peeing on the checker floor. So rather than using YouTube suggestion, let's use my suggestion. You see, that's what YouTube suggested that I use. They usually give you three thumbnails and it automatically picked that one. I was gonna use this one, but it picked that one. So I said, okay, YouTube, you have it your way then, right? <laughs> so I just put this one. Y'all see me put this one, right? Let me click save changes. Now let's scroll all the way down. All changes saved, right? All right, guys, so right now I'm about to hit the post office. I got the free giveaway camera already wrapped up and ready to be shipped to Germany. Now, I thought I'd give y'all a heads up on some finds that I found today. You guys remember how I was talking about one man's trash is another man's treasure. Well, I found some weird stuff and I found some cool stuff. I'm gonna start off with the weird stuff. This was kind of cool. I was looking at it when I saw it, I'm like, ew, that joint looked tough. It looked like it'd be a cool prop or like you could use it to like collect stuff or something. So when I opened it up, it still works and all. Check that out. When I opened it up, I saw this and I thought this was crazy. Look at it. This is weird, y'all. Look at it, look at it. This is like some type of, I don't know what is it, like a cow, right? But this is like a heavy sack. And then check out what was inside of it. Like little pins. You know how people be like poking those, those voodoo dolls or something, right? Right, right, right. Doesn't that look like it? Look at it. the cow's ear broke off right here. But I thought this was crazy. What do you think about this? What is this? Could it be like a voodoo doll or am I just over exaggerating? I still think the box is cool. See, you got like all these little sleeves and stuff. Well, I pulled that from the trash, yo. Look, it closes and all of that. Look at, check it out. Bam! Nice little handle and it still works. So I'm gonna wipe that down and keep that. Now, I found these two. No, there ain't no laptops in there. I wish, right? But boxes can be sold on eBay. People buy original boxes to items if you have them in good, in good condition. You can mark these for like five bucks a pop, you know what I mean? Somebody will buy them. I found those, but guess what I found next to those? You're not gonna believe me. Dog, a laptop. <laughs> Yo, listen, I don't even care if it work or not. It probably does. I'm banking on it still working. Maybe they lost the charger or something. Um, 
But yo, look at a whole John, a whole laptop, dog. Yeah, it's an older model. You know, they got all the new Johns out now. It might need a charger. I don't know. I'm gonna see if I can borrow someone's charger later to see if I can charge it and see if it still works. If it doesn't work, again, I found it for free. I can post this online on eBay for parts. You know, for parts or repair, somebody can use it for parts for their old laptop or repair it if they're tech savvy and resell it. So I'm looking at maybe if it doesn't work, 20 bucks for parts. If it works, I might just hold on to that John I thought use it as a prop or, or, or something, dog. Like that was free, a free laptop. You know, Husky still got the battery and everything in it. Yeah, that's what's up. And last but not least, I found, look at Josh of Life a me <laughs> I don't know what that was supposed to mean but check it out I guess whoever owned this stuff used to draw dog ain't that cool like why would they throw this away this is so cool I was looking at some of his artwork and I'm like yo dog why you throw your art away dog you're supposed to take this with you when you, when you move this is the type of stuff that you take with you yo look he, look, he was creative he put a face on like a scorpion body and there's an ice cream right there bunch of notes and stuff look at this my man has some talent dog look at the etching and look at the details and he did, and he did that with a pen yo i thought that was tough and i'm just sharing it with you guys because i can appreciate art and i'm saddened that they threw it away but guess what i appreciate it so much that i'm gonna keep it look at he even gave me his pencil his magical pencil and i draw dog what if i finish off his book that'd be crazy right now i'm not gonna disrespect him and finish off his book but I think this is tough, dog. Look at it. My man has some talent. These are his little sketches. I guess this was a sketchbook. But if he threw this away, I can only imagine the artwork that he kept. You know what I mean? He probably kept the, the good stuff and just threw away the stuff that he didn't care about. Yeah, look at that. It's pretty neat, huh? And this. It looks like a little diary. I don't know. It's brand new, though. For the, for the most part, there's really no notes kept in it. There's like one page of of what's that called scribbles or i don't know drawings and then the rest of it is empty right what was that on the last page let's see let's see go 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 yeah whoa whoa dude this this dude drew some some people with a marker yo he was going in did it, did he have a male friend oh snap dog i think he had a male friend that's two males laying in bed together, dog. Uh-oh, I don't think I was supposed to find this book. But guess what? Ain't no discriminating over here. I'm gonna keep this, John, dog. I'm just not gonna be doing what he was doing in it. <laughs> All right, so maybe it did cost me my arm and my leg. Check it out. Germany, $23.50. Let's see if anything changed. That'd be crazy if it changed, right? No, it still hasn't changed. But look it. Now I got the new cover art.